Kai Show FM as it's me, FM Cheetah. You can call me Matt. And welcome back to episode six of Roving to the Top. Well, not the top of the championship anyway. We are still in fourth place on 56 points, two points ahead of Watford uh, and three points ahead of Bournemouth. Why is that important? Because one of the games today will be Watford, but not right now. Today, uh, it's an away game to Forest. Uh, so let's have a look at the progress. So only a short break from the last games, which are, of course, the two draws uh, against Swansea and Middlesbrough. We then bounce back with a 1-1 against uh, Luton Town at home, and then a 1-1 against QPR uh, away. And then we managed to... Uh, we had a little, another... Um, the second of our um, uh, derbies against Preston. 2-1 win. So that is uh, two wins over Preston, I believe, for this season, right? Yeah, same scoreline, too. And then the last game, 4-1 over Barnsley, revenging our third round FA Cup defeat. How did we go when we faced them in the league? 2-2, so big improvement, 4-1. So those two wins have been important. So they were important because um, Cardiff 1-0 away win to Luton. Um, and, oh no, sorry, Watford. The Watford 4-0 away win over Preston. So they're keeping the pressure on. Uh, Bournemouth are sniffing around as well. Bournemouth and Watford have really fall. I mean, Watford's really falling away. Uh, Norwich struggled a bit in their last game. Brentford still in there. I mean, Cardiff have been the ones who have bounced back, I think. So um, that's it. So Forest, as you can see, down here in 13th, underperforming. Who's there now? Gary Brazil. Is he the actual... He is still the caretaker manager. Good club to go in and manage, but not us. Um, so we need a win here um, just to maintain the pressure. Who was with us today? Um, Cardiff against Preston um, at home, so you expect them to win. And where's Watford? And Watford at home to Derby. Again, you'd expect a win. Um, and Bournemouth, because Bournemouth are close to us. And Bournemouth away to QPR. Hmm, Yeah. Yeah, so we need we need the three points today. And that's no, I mean, you know, it's very similar to a lot of these games. It's not a given. Uh, it's a way. Uh, nonetheless, terrific performance, can I tell you. Actually, let's talk about last game. Here are the goals. Uh, so Dolan, outright, boy, that thing is traveling. Cuts in, Armstrong puts it away. Nice goal to Armstrong there. Why is that flying so fast? Here we go, Armstrong, through ball to Tomas. How often have we seen that? Tomas puts it away. Armstrong and Tomas, hey? So that's one assist, one goal. And Chaplin scores this. Pff, joke. So we're now 2-1. This is still half time, I believe. Armstrong flies. He's coming, he's coming. Hey, there's Tomas. Bam. Second assist, second goal. All right. And here we go. Davenport finds Tomas. Buckley He's moving, he's looking, he's looking. Finds Tomas. Armstrong does a little dummy run there. There you go. Very nice. Buckley had a nice game. So Tomas with the hat trick. So if we look at goals uh, for the season, Tomas is on 18, I mean, uh, sorry, 18, he is 18, he's on 17 goals, only two goals behind uh, Todd Cantwell. Well, Todd Cantwell is this golden meister at the moment. Uh, Shane Long, as you'd expect, scoring, he really is pulling that team along. But 17 goals from Tomas, proving he's a thing. Armstrong has dropped away, really, by virtue of his position. Um, yeah, I mean, he's proving the investment. If, yeah, if only we could buy him afterwards. I mean, what, can we just have a look at his development too? I mean, 18. This is ridiculous. I mean, this is a premiership player. Very good. Anyway, yeah, so those two together. I wonder if if you put them... They don't have any relationship up front. Douglas and, and Armstrong have developed a relationship. This isn't happening. Anyway, yeah. So, um, yeah. So I wonder if what would happen... Uh, Harvey Elliott, uh, I don't know if you're aware, he's still out. He picked up an injury, he's still out, so he won't be playing. Anyway, let's have this meeting. Uh, no suggestions? Just do that. 4 4 2. Um, it's only been a few days since the last game, so there might be a few ties. <laughs> Lewis Travelers is looking forward to meeting Luke Freeman. You know, when the ball winning midfielder tells you he's looking forward to meeting someone, it's like, yep, no. Let's get in the dressing room. Um, Pick up where you left off. That's always a goodie, isn't it? Hey, when has that not been a goodie in Football Manager? I tell you, always a goodie. So we get in the promotion places, but well, maybe the later game against Watford 
will give us some sort of indication whether we're really any sort of chance for a promotion playoff because we certainly haven't been great against those teams from memory. From memory. Dak has suffered a possible injury. All right, I'll do it. Yeah, well, I guess it is Buckley. Oh, is that there? That'll be a shot for them off target. Yeah, I mean, we need more than a point. Uh, Cardiff are leading against Preston, so we need to stay within touching distance. Although it's not Cardiff we need to be worried about, is it? Bryce Samba with a kick. Can Nambi get on it? He can, but there's no time. Where was, where was Tyrese when you need him? Oh, Kafita's playing. But he'd be told now. Yeah, they're moving the ball around. 4-4-2 has been quite a decent formation um, this season. Oh, Buckley. Oh, lovely. Lovely stuff. Put him, feed him through. Come on, Thiago. Can he finish it? No. No, too wide, too weak. Bournemouth with a win is, with a goal, is a problem. Uh, let's do a bit of encouraging, hey? Samba with the kick again. Let's get on it. No, Lyle Taylor. No. Okay, good. What, what, why would you... What is Barry Douglas doing kicking the ball out? Honestly. Not sure what to think of this. I do know... Yep, Bennett. Oh, Bennett. Hmm. Hmm. What do we think? What do we think of that? Yeah, keep it up. That looks fine. I'm not sure. Now, the question is, so who's... Tyrese is looking not great. Do we want to go like for like? Do we have a 4-4-2 in us? We do have a 4-4-2 in us. But I don't want to bring Buckley on. I just put him up. So the question is... And, and the two midfielders are looking very solid. Do we bring Travis off? How's Buckley's tackling? I can never remember. It's not bad. All right, so... Deep line playmaker. Bring Brereton on. Yeah, let's do it. He's looking inspired. Ah, oh, they're motivated. Let's just, let's get him in. Let's meet him one for one. Oh, Namby with a throw. Buckley. Finds Johnson. Dolan, Buckley. Dolan's on it. That's nice. Do it. Put it in. Armstrong with the goal. Nice. Tomas and Armstrong. Those two, hey? They're very, very good. So Dolan, keep, this is it's just he's, he's got some lovely pace on him. I mean, he's a really nice player. So McKenna doesn't clear it, and then, yeah. So Thomas does something, and then tip of the foot. Wait, it's not Thomas's goal, is it? No, it's Armstrong's goal. Uh, more familiar position. Hmm. Oh. Oh, yes, Tyrese, lovely. Come on. Finds Johnson. Burton. Oh, he finishes. Nice. Well, hmm. there you go. Yeah, I, I, I hear what you're saying. I hear what you're saying. Uh... Let's just let's just give him a chance. Look at that. What we, yep, we we get it. He's onside. Dolan through to Berriton finishes. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Ah, uh, here we go. All right. Burrow with a throw. Mbaso, Kronovic, Kafu. Is that Glenn Murray? Is he there? He's old. No, come on, come on, come on. No. I will bring Armstrong off. And I will bring Ben Johnson off and we'll play him as a ball in midfielder. Wow, Davenport anxious. He's just anxious all the time, isn't he? Bournemouth 2-0 against QPR, so this is an important win. But what did... Uh, here we go. Mbasso with the throw. Come on. What's happening? No. Maybe... Uh, 
Come on, do not. A, a draw is not enough here. We want the win. Do we want to go positive to put a bit of pressure on them? Why was Thiago Tomas only on a 6.9? There we go. Douglas fires it in. Come on, get it in. Frankie oh, Yes, Rankin Costello, second goal of the season. Lovely, that'll do him well. Dolan is looking tired. Nice. Bournemouth 3 0 over QPR. Yep, this was an important win. Very, very nice. Rankin Costello. Good substitution. All right, we need a righty out there. Um, mm, 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 mm. So what we do is, and then he becomes the wing and he becomes the thing. Yep. Go out and make a difference. You're complacent, are you, Joe? Joe is just happy about that. I'll change it back to balanced in a second. Oh, Tabby. Nice. All right. Let me change it back now. Oh, and let's just watch this in Basso. Grabbing. Ooh. Okay, so defensive. Long. Let's see it out. Kaminsky. Hmm. No. Focus. I didn't like that at all. No, don't do this to me. Are you fucking kidding me? Save it. Come on, Kaminsky. Do it. No, no, no. Rap. Leave it, leave it. Damn it. We hang it in fourth. Bournemouth jump Watford. We're fortunate that Derby um, beat Watford in the end, didn't they? Where are they? Hello, hello, hello. Oh, no, they ended up with the draw. <sighs> Cardiff, though, they're pulling further and further ahead. Shocking. Shocking, shocking, shocking. And now we've got Watford. Wow, that was disappointing. All right. Uh, it is at home, isn't it? Tell me it's at home. It is at home. Cool. All right. And how far away is it? It's only a few days. A few days. All right. Let's see if we can get three points from Watford. Three points from Watford would be nice. If we get, who are they? Let's just have a look here. We'll go back to the fixtures. Uh, next set of fixtures on Tuesday. Nothing to worry about there, really. And then we have Watford. Bournemouth have Cardiff. Oh, nice. Okay. That's interesting. What do we want? I guess the truth is we probably want a Cardiff win, don't we? Better to secure fourth than to risk Bournemouth pushing us down to fifth. Yeah. Okay. All right. That'll do for now. I'll see you in a moment for the game against Watford. Bang. And we're back for the second game of today's episode. It's a home game against Watford. Um, this day, match day, is the highlight is probably Bournemouth and Cardiff. As we said earlier, I, I guess a Cardiff. I mean, if we win, let them draw. No, I suppose I'd still... I mean, a Cardiff win and us winning is probably still, at the end of the day, the better result for us. 
Uh, Norwich won their game, so they're six points ahead. I, th I think, you know, it's, it's going to be hard to touch them. Brentford have Wednesday, who are, you know, they're not relegated. I mean, it's tight down there. It's pretty tight, but, man, I mean, you know, it, it, you, you'd expect you're going to lose that if you're Wednesday. Um, that's it. Uh, only uh, note, of course, we know that Dak picked up an injury, so he will be out for today's uh, game. Nothing to change. Just some opposition. Four two three one. So we're all playing four two three one. So Baker, I'm going to start Baker over um, Buckley, and hope I don't live to regret it, uh, because um, he, you know he, he's probably a more natural in that role, and he's got some you know mad sort of stats there he loves to pass the ball um, I think he's good and I'd like to give him a go I know he's only 18 Buckley is there if it doesn't work out so he can come into that role but let, let's give him a go I say we do it so we we got to give Gabri uh, uh, a go uh, Travis is on the edge of picking up he'll pick up his card and get his um, uh, get his suspension. We're in good form. Go out and impress me. I have a bit of the old faith healing that does well, and we're away. The Bournemouth and Cardiff game is the game we want to keep on. And I guess, like I said, we, I guess we want Cardiff to win that really. Baker Braithwaite, Branthwaite, sorry Branthwaite. Baker is looking around. See Travis. No, no, no. Zinkanagel. Travis trying to, oh yes, lovely. Dolan's no coming inside. Bit of interest in Dolan, by the way. Oh yes, Travis, yeah, yes, Adam Armstrong. Yeah, Torres, Travis getting a lot of attention from uh, City and somewhere else, so they're looking for him. Uh, nice, they can have him for 400 million. So Dolan cutting in, not like him. Adam makes the run. Dolan threads him through. Lovely outside of the foot finish from Armstrong, and we are one goal to the good there's some very good players in that Watford team isn't there Saar Hughes is solid um, Chalabar is pretty solid Bournemouth are winning that's not the scoreline we want come on Cardiff bounce back let's give him a bit of encouragement then let's see how that goes down and the throw who's this Nevada Nevada with a throw finds Saar let's get that ball back please no Lovely save by Kaminsky. Oh no, oh no, side of the net. Okay, well, good closing down. Come on, Cardiff, get that, um, get that goal. Cleverly. Okay, yeah, cool. Still. Nevada, uh, Travis, was it? Was the? Was he on a yellow? Yeah. <laughs> I wonder whether we might want to uh, bring on um, uh, McIntyre going forward. Um, I mean, six five, and he, if we look at his average, there's a lot of six sixes there too. And obviously, not having a great game today. All right, um, so don't get complacent is the aim of the game here. So I am going to bring on Davenport because Travis is out for the next game anyway, and I am going to bring on Tom McIntyre. I have faith. Well, Davenport's looking uh, motivated. That's good. Oh, see my cat there? <laughs> cat rescue there. Cat rescue. Hello, what's happened? Nothing. Good. Yeah, I'm sure you can definitely hear that now. It's moving. I'm about to be attacked by a cat. Okay, 63rd minute. <laughs> Sorry, I'm taking this game very seriously. Uh, okay, Dolan is having a good game, but he is tired. Um, I'm bringing on... Hey, sorry about that. I'm going to bring on Rankin Costello just because he had a good game. And I'm going to bring on Buckley because Bag is not having the best of games. And pump the fists, go make the difference. They're composed. Well, it's good that they're composed, hey? Well, Tiago Tomas is not having the best of games. So, and they're catching us. Look at that. Wow, there are cats all over me. So here's what we're going to do. Brereton's coming on for Tomas. Do we want to swap them? I'm going to swap them. Go out there and make a difference. He's composed. Everyone's super composed. That's good. It's good to be composed. Damn, they're catching up. Buckley's picked up a knock. I can't afford... Uh, I'll sort it. I 
can't do it. I can't do it. Okay, I can't do it. My buckles, I might just go back to balanced. I have no idea. Ah, oh dear. I'm going to regret this. McIntyre clears. Gosling, Shalabar. Come on, Gosling. Can we please get rid of that ball? No. Oh dear, dear, oh dear, oh dear. What is going on? No. Boy. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. Unhappy? Sure, I'm unhappy. I want three points. What is going on? It's not cats, I swear. I mean, I, I wouldn't have changed the way I played anyway. We've got five minutes. Do it. Come on. Wow. No, I'm not happy. I'm not happy with the performance. Any chance they got a draw in the other game? Cardiff won. Okay, well, I guess... Sure. <laughs> sure. Okay, so everything back to normal except we're now slipping. We're, we're, we're stuck in fourth for sure. Wow. Okay, fine. This makes me think that at the end of the season when, you know, because we're going to play Bournemouth, I guess. I think it works. Cardiff will play. I mean, if everything were to stay the same, Cardiff would play Watford and we'd play Bournemouth, I feel. I don't know what our luck's been against Bournemouth, but um, yeah. Wow. And Brentford, uh, they played today, didn't they? Yep, 1-0 over Wednesday. Yep. Great. That's terrible. I'm unhappy. I'm unhappy. Let's go. How long's Buckles out for? He's out for five to nine days. Rest will lead him to the physio. Um, oh, there's Mourinho after. Yeah, Mourinho's after um, Torres Dominic as well. Just out of interest. 2024, and there's no option to buy, is there? No. And what's he worth? Probably not all that. 34, yeah, you can give me 20 million for him. That sounds great. Okay. It's getting to the tough end of the season. We've only got a couple of games here left. Um, Brentford and Norwich are in there. That's fairly meaningless. Reading and Millwall. Uh, Rotherham and Birmingham. Is that how we're going to end the season? Or we're not because we're going to have, fingers crossed, going to have playoffs. Bournemouth and Cardiff are super important. So I say we skip March, we come back for that. And then feasibly, depending on how it looks, either come back for Rotherham and Birmingham or we go straight to the playoffs if we're in the playoffs. Makes sense? Good. All right. Thank you for joining me today. Two draws. Oh, I don't know. Yep, sure. You know, if Thiago's not firing, it just doesn't happen, does it? Yeah, okay. Thumbs up if you like what you saw. If you just, again, have a bit of mercy for two draws. Um, you're here, you're still here, but if you haven't subscribed, make sure you do that. Cats today. Apologies for the cats. It's cat day. Um, yeah, so we're going to come back. Millennium Stadium. No, sorry. Here at um, uh, here at Ewood Park and then away to the Millennium Stadium. They're bumper games. They're super important. Four points. We want four points from that for sure. For sure. So, thank you again. Until next time. Last of our